Good morning, Lower Casa students. It's Mrs. McKillop here for some music time, and I'm so excited to be with you. It's great to see you. Awesome. All right, let's sing our hello song so that we can get started. Here we go. A one, two, ready, sing. Hello, hello, it's music time today. I'm glad you're here. It's time to sing and play. We'll clap our hands, stomp our feet, pat our knees, and take a seat. Hello, hello, it's music time today. I'm glad you're here. It's time to sing and play. Well done, boys and girls. Thank you so much for singing. I love to hear your voices. So the first thing that we're going to do this morning is we're actually going to make our own shaker. So you might have some shakers at home. I have my favorite shaker. Everybody knows that I love playing the orange shaker. You might have a shaker at home already, but just in case you don't have a shaker, I'm gonna teach you how to make one. So all you need is a small container. I have one here. So this is a, some Tupperware. And this one is actually good because it's got the locking sides, but any Tupperware will do. You can always fasten the sides with tape if you need to, to make sure that it's secure. And I've also got some rice. Now anything will work. Um, beans will work, not anything will work, I guess, but lentils, um, you know, some dried beans, some corn kernels, things like that will work. Anything that's hard and small will work. And I've got a quarter of a cup, okay? So this part is for parents. Hope you're tuning in. All right. So I'm just going to put, this might be too much. I don't know. I'm put a little quarter of a cup in here. Might be too much. And let's see, we'll test it out. So it fills up about that much. And then I'm going to lock the side. And we're going to shake. Simple, right? Okay, let's rock out to our favorite Wee Kids rock song. You know this one from class. Ready? Let's go. That was so good. All right, I'm going to stop that there. Excellent. Wow, isn't that cool that you can find 
things to make a shaker in your own kitchen. That is so awesome. All right, we are going to review our dynamic markings. So what is the word for loud in music? Do you remember what the word is for loud in music? Let's hear. If you said forte, you are right. Let's play our shakers loud. Forte. Good job. And stop. Excellent. We can make a stop with our fist like this. See my big hand there? Stop. Excellent. Can you try it? Ready, go. Stop. You did it. Good job. And the opposite of loud is soft. Soft. What's the word for soft in music? Yes, the word for soft is piano. So let's play piano, ready? And stop. Good job, all right. So let's sing our shaker song and we're gonna do it loud, forte, and then we'll do it soft, piano. Here we go, a one, two, three. We're gonna shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake our shakers loud and stop. Good work, everybody. All right, now we're gonna do it soft. Piano, a one, two, Three. We're gonna shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake our shaker softly and stop. Good for you. Excellent job. And if you want to review loud and soft again, you can just go back in this video. It's really cool. You can use it quite a few times, which is awesome. All right. Now I want to know the word for fast in music. What's the word for fast in music? Presto. That's right. Some of you know this one really well. Presto. So we're going to play presto. Ready? Let's go. Presto. Good job. And the opposite of fast is slow. Do you remember what the word for slow is? Let's hear. You're right. It's largo. Very slow. Largo. Very slow. So we're going to sing our shaker song and we're going to sing it fast, presto, and then we're going to sing it slow, largo. Here we go, ready? Oh, what two, three, we're going shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake, and shake, and shake, and stop. shake our shakers fast and stop. Good job. Can you go even faster, do you think? Yes? Okay, here we go. Oh, what two, three, we're going shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake our shakers fast. Whoa, very good. All right, now we're gonna do the opposite and we're gonna go slowly. So we're gonna say largo. Here we go. A one, two, ready, go. We're gonna shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake and shake and shake and stop. Shake our shakers slowly and stop. Good job, my friends. You did so well with that. All right, we are going to move on to our Easter Bunny song. Did you know that it's gonna be Easter this weekend? Wow, I can't believe it. And it's been pretty nice outside. So I have been enjoying the warmer weather and going out for walks. Have you been playing outside too? Yes, that's so great. All right, so here is the Easter Bunny song. 
it sounds like this. I'm gonna play it for you first and then I'll teach you the words, okay? Here we go. Oops, I already made a mistake. That's okay, because I can just start it again. Here I go. One, two. That's the very first part. Now I'm gonna show you what I'm playing on because you might be wondering. I am playing on my favorite xylophone and it's shaped like a bear. No, it's not shaped like a bear. It's shaped like a cat. No, it's not shaped like a cat. I don't know what I'm thinking. It's shaped like a frog. I don't, I don't know. I had the wrong cereal this morning. It is not a frog. This is an elephant and it makes a beautiful sound. Isn't that nice? All right. So I'm going to sing the words for you now. Let's try it. Daffodils and yellow chickies. Daffodils are those really nice flowers in the sun, in the spring, actually. We see them popping up in the yard and they're usually yellow and sometimes white. Let's try singing that together. Ready, sing. Daffodils and yellow chickpeas. I'm going to say some more animal names. Listen. Lambs and bunnies hopping quickly. Lambs and bunnies hopping quickly. Lambs and bunnies. Here we go. Try that with me. Ready, sing. Lambs and bunnies hopping quickly. Good job. Let's go back to the daffodils and yellow chickies. Here we go. One, two, ready, sing. Daffodils and yellow chickies, lambs and bunnies hopping quickly. The next part goes like this. Sing a song of springtime. So it goes springtime. And spring is the season that we're in. Spring is the season that we're in. So sing a song of springtime. Sing a song of springtime. Good job, everybody. Soon it will be Easter. That's so true. It's going to be Easter soon. Sing that with me. Ready? Soon it will be Easter. Very good. All right, the next part is my favorite part, but let's go back and review one more time from Sing a Song of Springtime. Here we go. Ready, sing. Sing a song of springtime. Soon it will be Easter. Very, very good. Now the next part is my favorite part. And if you have a bunny at home, maybe you can help by hopping the bunny at home. I only have a bear and a mouse and I don't think I have a bunny here. I think I have to find a bunny. All right, so the next part goes like this. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Let's have you try that with me, ready? And you can hop along with your, or you can hop along. You can pretend to be an Easter bunny, pretty cool. Ready, sing. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Good, and then we do that again, but we do it in a lower key, so listen. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Those were a little bit lower notes. Let's try it again. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Good job. And then we go back up to the higher notes again. You know it. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Did you do it? Yay. And then this is how we finish the song. It goes like this. Please come to visit. Please come to visit because the Easter bunny likes to bring chocolates. 
So let's try that again. Please come to visit. All right, good job, everybody. Let's try the whole song now. And you can get ready with your hippity hoppity bunny. You can even have hippity hoppity bunny ears. Awesome, good job. I like those bunny ears. Okay, do you remember what we start with? If you said daffodils, you are correct. Here we go. There we go. All one, two, ready, sing. Daffodils and yellow chickies, lambs and bunnies hopping quickly. Sing a song of springtime. Soon it will be Easter. Ready, bunnies? Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Hippity hoppity Easter bunny. Please come to visit. Yay! You did the Easter bunny song. Very well done. I'm very happy with that. All right. Now, I would like to do a song called Shake Your Sillies Out. So if you are sitting down and listening to music, I want you to get up and let's have some fun. Here we go. So whatever action that I sing in my song, that's what you're gonna do at home. And some people know this song. Uh, it might have a little bit of a different tune or a little bit of different words, but I like to make up my own words because I'm crazy like that. Here we go. Ready? A one, two, three. We're gonna shake, shake, shake our sillies out. Shake, shake, shake our sillies out. Shake, shake, shake our sillies out. Wiggle our waggles away. Good. When I get to the wiggle our waggles away, that's like you're pretending you have a tail like a dog and you're gonna wiggle your waggles away. Excellent. And then every other part of the song you're gonna shake your sillies out i know you can do it here we go one more time a one two three we're gonna shake 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 our sillies out shake 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 our sillies out shake 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 our sillies out wiggle our waggles away awesome all right get ready we're gonna clap Clap our crazies out. Here we go. A one, two, three. We're gonna clap, clap, clap our crazies out. Clap, clap, clap our crazies out. Clap, clap, clap our crazies out. Wiggle our waggles away. Did you get the wiggle our waggle away part? Yeah? Awesome. All right, now we're gonna jump our jumpies out. Why not? Can you jump really high in the sky? Can you touch the ceiling when you jump? Are you not that high yet? That's okay, you're gonna grow. I don't even know if your parents can touch the ceiling when they jump. Probably not, right? All right, here we go. A one, two, three, we're gonna jump, jump, jump our jumpies out, jump, jump, jump our jumpies out. job. What's something else that we can do? We can shh, shh, shh our sillies out. Shh, shh, shh our sillies out. I just made it up on the spot. Let's try it. A one, two, three. We're gonna shh, shh, shh our sillies out. Shh, We will take a break from that for now. And I would like to know, I don't know what kind of instruments you have at home, but right now we are going to play on a drum. One moment. Oh, I'm back. 
All right. And I have a drum, a nice red drum. And it has a beautiful sound like this. Very nice. You might not have a drum at home, and you might, but just so you know, you can make a drum out of many different things. So I could make a drum out of a Tupperware container, or I could make a drum out of a box. Um, what other things? You could make a drum out of a table, or you can just play on your legs if you like for now. Okay, but we'll probably be using a drum. So if you can find something in your house that is a good drum to play, that would be great. You don't need to buy one. You can just play something that you have. All right. So this is called keeping the beat or play the beat with me. Okay. And it's done to the tune of London Bridge. So if you know that tune, London Bridge is falling down falling down. You might know that too. Okay. So this is called tap your drum and play with me. All right, here we go. We're just going to keep a nice steady beat on the drum. So if you can do that with me. Good. So this is like ta, 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 ta. Tap your drum and play with me. Play with me. You did it. And so that is called keeping the beat. Okay? If we were to play the rhythm of the song, it would sound like this. Tap your drum and play with me. Play with me. Play with me. Tap your drum and play with me. Play the beat. But we're not playing the rhythm. We're playing the beat. So we're going to keep that nice steady beat. Ta, 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 ta. Awesome job. All right, here we go. Let's play it one more time on our drums. Already go. Tap your drum and play with me. Play with me. Play with me. Tap your drum and play with me. Play the beat. Excellent job. All right, something else that you might have in your house are a pair of rhythm sticks. And if you don't have rhythm sticks, you might have two wooden spoons. This is kind of a spoon, but anyway, it still works. They actually sound really good together. So if you could get two wooden spoons, that would be awesome. And we'll be able to tap out some rhythms. So let's do tap your sticks and play with me. Here we go. Ready, sing, tap your sticks and play with me, play with me, play with me, tap your sticks and play with me, play the beat. Excellent job, awesome work. You could even play today if you don't have any, you could play with your fingers. Yeah, just keep the beat, find a way to keep the beat. Here we go, let's try one more time, ready? Tap your sticks and play with me, play with me, Play with me, tap your sticks and play with me, play the beat. Excellent job, all right. And one more, we know you made a shaker. So you've got a shaker at home, this is excellent. And we'll say shake your shaker and play with me. Here we go, try to keep it to the beat. It's hard with a shaker, here we go. Ready, sing, shake your shaker and play with me. Play with me, play with me, shake your shaker and play with me, play the beat. Excellent job, very, very good. All right, I am going to show you another Easter song. And I'm just gonna pull it up here. Let's listen to the tune. Oh, that's 
a tune. All right, so I have five little bunnies to come and visit with you today. So let's count the bunnies. Ready? One, two, three, four, four. Oh, this bunny doesn't want to play. There we go. And five little bunnies. Hello, bunnies. All right, here's the song. Are you ready? <gasps> hey, bunnies. Five little bunnies hopping on the floor. One hopped away and then there were... <gasps> How many bunnies? One, two, three, four. Four. Four little bunnies hide behind a tree. Boo! One climbed away and then there were one, two, three. Good job. Three little bunnies wondered what to do. One went to sleep and then there were two good job two little bunnies want to have some fun one hopped down a hole and then there was one you got it one little bunny paddling in the sea i went and picked him up and he came home with me all right, did you end up with one bunny too? Awesome. I can actually send out um, a little coloring sheet for that one. I think you would have a lot of fun and you could make your own bunny puppets to sing with me on Friday. That would be really cool. So I will send that to your teacher if she doesn't already have it. Excellent job. Wow, we did so much today. Beautiful singing, beautiful playing. I had so much fun. So let's sing our solfege signs and then we will sing our goodbye song. All right, here we go. Oh, you can hardly see. So we'll start with do, two fists for do. Do, re, re is like a little mountain. And then we straighten that up. Mi, fa, thumbs down. So, good job. La, good work. Ti, do. Now it's time to say goodbye. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. I really enjoyed today. Thank you for singing and playing, and I will see you on Friday. Have a great week. Thank you.